So Ether Energy is uh, started off build, uh, primarily the focus of battery packs, hence we call Ether Energy, not Ether Motors. Uh, obviously, uh, we, we, we inherently believe the future of uh, future of transportation is going to be electric. Mm -hmm. uh, so it was the easiest business proposition, really. Like petrol, make petrol companies make more money than uh, automotive vehicles uh, companies today, right? So mm -hmm. uh, batteries to electric vehicles, access to petrol is to today's combustion vehicles. Uh, so it was a very obvious business proposition. So we started off building battery packs. I think uh, we were the first company that had uh, uh, a completely in-house built lithium-ion battery pack along with the battery management system. So that's where our core IP remains. Uh, but we realized uh, that's not enough because we didn't have any place to put it into. Uh, rest of the electric vehicles, uh, the biggest problem was the battery pack, yes. We could fix the battery pack and we probably would provide you a little more speed and a little more range. But then uh, the way the vehicle looked, the way the vehicle felt, they were still considered urban mobility vehicles. They weren't full-fledged vehicles. So we realized for people to, add, and, and there was this baggage that electric vehicles are meant for the old, uh, slow sort of market, right? And in fact, that's not true at all because we realize electric technology is far superior to petrol uh, or diesel technology, right? With respect to part weight ratio, talk delivery, and stuff like that. So uh, we thought we sort of needed to do this from scratch. Uh, so it's not enough, we just build great technology. For people to adopt that, we sort of had to build great products as well. So we said we'll just build the whole vehicle grounds up.